everyone, it's Buddy here, and today we are unboxing the Praying Mantis. First, we're going to take a look at the kit. Whenever it comes in in four days, I will cut the video. It'll be instantly for y'all, it'll be a long wait for me. So we bought, we got, we just got back from Petco. We got ourselves some leaves and um, a pet keeper box. Let's do this. So, Hard doing this with one hand. So we should let's take the top off. Hmm, I'm gonna do this with two hands because it's impossible with one. Is this thing even possible to come off? I hope so. Yeah, it is. There we go. We got it, guys. Get in. Okay, so it's off now. So let's pull out these magazines. Let's pull out this tape. We're gonna pull our mantis now, do we? The mantis isn't in here right now, but it'll be cut so you guys are gonna be able to see it. So, now what will we do? So, we have this basic lid. We're gonna go clean it up, but first, let's unbox this bag. So, well, doing it with one hand is not easy. So, here we go. I'm gonna have to do this again. Okay, cool. Staples of this stupid thing. So it's open now. It's open. It's open. And then let's open this thing up. And here we go. Here's our big plant. Let's take all these staples out. I'll clean this up later in my hand. So, um, yeah. Let's put this on the back. This right here, it is on. Guys, don't worry about this. We will I'll cut the video. I'll get some sticks and leaves and whatnot from the back of the room. Then I will be very soon. This thing does not come off. Oh, it's stuck. Here we go again, guys. Well, guys, I'll come back whenever I add the sticks and leaves. Hello everyone, Buddy here, and we're going back from outside that we collected our sticks for our new praying mantis. So here we go, pile of sticks. This is plastic. This thing is made of plastic. You're probably going to like this thing the most. Okay. These are the twigs that I got from outside. Clean them off and everything before put them in the mantis cage. I recommend you do that if you're getting a pet praying mantis. Clean little leaves and twigs off so no parasites on there could in infect your mantis. It's highly recommended. So we're gonna set this up. And if y'all don't like it, go ahead, leave a comment. And the praying mantis will be coming soon. It's gonna be a slow video. We got our got a little lid. So guys. Let's set this up. So what I was thinking, doing this with one hand is not easy. Of course it isn't. So, what we're going to do, we're going to hang this. Hold on, you guys. Let me do this. How do I like this? I think it would like this. So now that the plants... Now that we have the plants attached and everything. So, this is the back of the cage. I think, I don't like it actually. I'm gonna change it up. Okay, so, we're gonna have this suction. This is really difficult. Come on, how does it look? That's it lower to the ground. Like, does it look just like a caterpillar or something? I think it does. Mm -mm. The mantis likes the back of its enclosure. A leech? Nope. A slug. That's a leech. Ask mom. Yeah, that's a leech. Morgan just caught a leech. He's going to pick it up and get sucked. 
So we're gonna add Sense mantises. Whatever. So first, let's add in the stick. Don't hold sticks. Don't hold these. This is beautiful. Jeez. There we go. Crack it open. Now let's do this. Mantis has a nice little stick to climb ab aboard. So we're gonna place that. Oh my, do we even need these twigs? I think we'll need them to balance this cage out. So we're gonna have a stick going this way. I think this is pretty good for mantis habitat. I don't know. So the mantis is going to want to chill in one particular spot. And the crickets are going to chill at the bottom. So we need a way for the crickets to climb up. So we're going to give the crickets a way to do that. Do so. So just like that, our mantis enclosure is complete. I don't know what we're going to name it. We'll y'all go ahead and leave a comment. What y'all want me to name my brand new mantis? Do you, you guys like it? If y'all like it, subscribe. If y'all don't like it, leave a dislike. Hold on, don't do that. No, don't leave a dislike. What am I saying? Don't do it. So... We're gonna give him some light. But for now, the enclosure is gonna have a So guys, we'll see you guys whenever the mantis comes in. Last cut of the video. What's up guys? Guess what? The mantis is here! Oh yeah, you can see him. He's a nymph for a giant African praying mantis. And, Yo. and um, we got his cage right here. With Loki Pokey, which With is going Loki to Pokey, which is flipped over, so obviously. Pokey Pokey. So guys, I'm gonna unbox him real quick. You can Morgan go take Loki Pokey outside into the wild. Got it. Since the mantis is a nymph only. Okay, where are you? Let's see. Dad, how do I grab him? Just like that. Just grab him by the wing so he can't fly. We're gonna let Roly Poly Loki go. Ah! He tried to fly, didn't he? Yep. Oh, just grab his wings so he can't fly. I'm not gonna grab him by the front to where he can't fly. He's poking me with something. It's his arm is like poking me. It's his little thing that to... You got him. Ow. Oh, he's trying. Yep, he's trying to fly. So go release like... him. Go release him on the front porch. On the front. He's already chilling. So guys. This looks to be a female. We're gonna actually keep her in her little box for now. So guys, it was expected it was expected to come in and, on my Tuesday. Jeez. Well guys, there you have it. The mantis is finally arrived. I will see you guys later. Buddy here, going out. Goodbye.